Hello, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you how to upload and distribute a podcast. So here we are choosing, first of all, our podcast host. There are many of them to choose from. I've chosen Spreaker because they're easy to use and I use them myself. So it's really easy to demonstrate how this works. First of all, go to the sign up page. All these details will be in the notes to this video, by the way, if you want to follow along and do this yourself. So I'm just typing in the standard stuff when you sign up to something uh, that's your name, email, and a password, agreeing to terms and conditions and privacy after reading them. Click sign up and it really is as simple as that. As soon as you've done that, you are in. You are ready to use Spreaker. It's going to ask you to follow some podcasts if you want to listen, but we want to create. So go into the create menu up here and then you want to upload like this. It takes you into the management system. Now, the first thing you'll need to do is select a show which you haven't created. So click this all shows button over here. And then it will give you the option to create a new show for your podcast. You can host multiple shows on one Spreaker account, which is cool. So I'm going to call this Adobe Audition Podcast. I'm going to upload an image I prepared earlier, which is just here. Usually the dimensions should be 3000 by 3000 and it can be PNG or JPEG. Get your image in there. Give it a description. The Adobe Audition Podcast hosted by Mike Russell. Now, obviously, if you were writing this, you'd probably make it a little bit longer. But just for uh, demonstration, I'm going to keep it nice and short. Choose a category. In this case, I'm going to go straight for technology. Create the show. Simple as that. You've got the show created and then you are ready to upload. OK, brilliant. Here it is. So let's go in and upload a show. Again, Upload Episodes appears just here on your show page, and it drops down a box there asking you for the file. Now, I've prepared this earlier in Adobe Audition, AAP01.mp3. That's an MP3 audio file that I created, a recording of my show. Double-click it to start uploading it, and you'll see this upload bar just zips along here, and it will show you the draft of your episode down here uploading until it gets to 100%. And when it is at 100%, you're ready to publish, and when you've published, you can then distribute your podcast to the various directories online. And I'm going to show you how to do that very, very simply. Right. Upload is complete. Let's go into the edit here of our first ever podcast episode. Uh, you'll see here lots of different information. You can give it a description. You can fill this all out if you want. I'm going to leave it blank for demonstration purposes and keep this really simple for you. Click publish now. Yes, publish. And that episode is now out there on my Spreaker account. Now, you can make an RSS feed uh, and link it into your WordPress site, but that's beyond the scope of this tutorial. I'm going to show you how to use the RSS feed that is provided inside your Spreaker account to distribute to all the podcast directories so that your podcast can be heard. And it's simple. It's this button here, RSS link uh, in your show page. And here it will give you a little URL that if we copy that and paste it into a new window, you will see it'll bring up oh a feed of your show, right? Looks rather complicated, but the podcast directories will love this feed and will uh, pick up your show. So just copy that feed, make sure you've copied it, Command C or uh, Control C if you're on a PC. And then you go to the various big directories. Uh, now, some of them you can submit through Spreaker, but the big three are, of course, Apple Podcasts, Stitcher and Google Play Music, which also has a podcast directory. Now they have a podcast app as well. All the links, again, in the note to this video, so go and find them all. This is the uh, Podcasts Connect uh, portal here, and I need to uh, log in here with my uh, Apple ID confirmation. So let's do that, 681209, using that two-factor authentication there. Okay, and we can choose to trust the browser. Now I'm going to log in to my, uh, it's just my iTunes account, which is used to host all of my podcasts. As you see, plenty of them here, all hosted. Uh, and we want to create a new podcast. So it's the plus button up here. And then you paste in that URL. Remember the URL we grabbed from Spreaker. And then the first thing you'll do is validate. Now, hopefully this will spin a circle around and it'll find the first episode that you just uploaded to Spreaker. If it finds that, 
that's good. The rest of your submission is going to be easy. If Apple recognize your podcast, which they've done, yep, look, there's the artwork. Here's the description we typed into Spreaker. Uh, there's the website link to our podcast on Spreaker. And there's our first podcast episode, uh, which, of course, I didn't title. So it's just AAP01. You probably give that a more user-friendly title. It's even got the duration. Make sure that looks correct as well. And if you're happy with all that, you would then click the Submit button. After clicking submit to Apple Podcasts, you usually have to wait between 24 to 72 hours and you'll find that your podcast starts showing up. It's a similar process for Stitcher. Log into their partner portal here. Again, you'll be taken into the portal and given the opportunity to add shows. Again, very simple here. You need to add a bit more information for Stitcher. Show name, again, RSS feed URL. It's exactly the same one that we grabbed from Spreaker. Uh, language English, find the uh, the category, technology will suit me. Current number of listeners, I'll say 0 to 100, of course. Uh, you can put in a Twitter handle as well with Stitcher, so why not? Facebook page if you want, I'll just leave that blank. And even keywords if you're old school as well. Agree to the terms and conditions and then click continue and you will have submitted your podcast to the Stitcher podcast directory. Then we want to distribute, of course, via Google. Everything needs to be via Google. Uh, so again, go to the URL that you'll find in the notes to this video and click Publish in Google Play Music. It'll come up with any podcast you've already added. After spinning around for a bit, you click the Add a Podcast button. And then it's as simple, again, as pasting in that RSS feed. See how the RSS feed is key? And then you click Submit RSS feed. And again, within a matter of time, for Stitcher and for Google, as with Apple Podcasts, your podcast will sh start showing up in these big directories, which are the big three really important directories to get your podcast into. Heading back to Spreaker, just to finalize this video on how to upload and distribute a podcast, I would like to show you a little bit more over here in your show page. Spreaker has the ability to get two more really important podcast directories. One, of course, Spotify, and one is iHeartRadio. So over here in this left-hand menu, click Spotify once you've uploaded your first episode. And you'll see here, in order to submit at the moment to Spotify, you need to have a pro account with Spreaker. So make sure to get that sorted out. It works differently with every different podcast host. So do look into that uh, for your means. But Spotify is an option right inside Spreaker if you have a pro account. Uh, the same is true for iHeartRadio. You can click to submit your show to iHeartRadio. At the moment, that's grayed out. And that is because you need to hit a certain limit, a certain number of episodes published uh, before Spreaker will allow allow you to submit to the iHeartRadio directory. So there you go. That is how you upload and distribute a podcast. I hope you found this video really handy. Use the links in the notes below to get started and let me know how you get on in the comments to this video. If there's any way I can help you with your podcasting journey, let me know in the comments and I'll do my very best to help you. 